Hello once again, I am Jim Ducart with TND How Videos. Today we will be watching cable injection. Our participating utility is Commonwealth Edison, and this video is sponsored by Burns and McDonald. Now let's start by listening to a job description at the pre-job safety briefing. Cable injection, check tagging, tie open, test, de-energize test, ground, remove elbows, TDR, air test. Um, LFA if needed, new elbow, flow test, pressure test, inject tag, phase, bring hot, tie, split, repeat. Uh, so that is quite the laundry list of tasks. We will show you as much as we can here in this short five minute video. It all starts by grounding the cable and they're doing that here using hot sticks at this pad mounted transformer. This is actually going to be the sending transformer as we will see later in the video. You're going to hear a little bit of breeze blown through the microphone. I'm also going to let the line crew tell you a little bit here about what they are doing in this grounding procedure. All right, we're going to test our tester. Show's hot. Cable's dead. Test begin. Show's hot. Cable's dead. I'm going to put our dust cap on. And with that cable now grounded, Craig will tell Matt on the receiving end that they're ready for right, TDR. Matt, we're in the clear, go ahead and TDR. Now here Craig is actually lifting the elbow from the ground so they can perform TDR on this cable. TDR stands for Time Domain <laughs> Reflectometry and here is Matt on the receiving end of this cable injection and he's going to put a device on here with some sensors that reads the cable. That's what TDR is. It reads not only the length of the cable, but also looks for faults or the beginning of abrasions in the insulation. That's what this injected fluid will repair. All right, I can see that your ground is lifted. We have 387 feet clean cable. Uh, please hold while I store. All right, Craig, I got you stored. And as Craig just said, time to create elbows on the sending end here. Right here, I cut a gap to let the fluid flow. Through. Just heard him say that he leaves an opening for the fluid to migrate through the elbow and along the cable. Next, he will attach a little air hose to that elbow so they can do the air test to the receiving side of this injection. Then they're going to just install that elbow and now Joe is going to tell us about making an injection bottle. All right, we're going to make an inject bottle. So we'll come in here, choose a bottle, get a whip for the bottle. It is a nine and a half inch bottle for the footage we're working with. Now we're going to back the bottle down, and now we're going to add 18 PSI. All right, and that's how you make a bottle. So now Joe brings that bottle over to Craig at the sending end, and he will attach that to the elbow, that whip to the elbow, so they can send fluid through to the other side of the injection. Right, we have an inch uh, fluid in. So now all nine inches of that fluid will migrate through the cable, along the cable, to repair faults or abrasions in the insulation. And meanwhile, you're going to do what's called a high pot and drain. All right, Matt, we have a good high pot, good drain. If you've got a meter in place, I'll bring it hot to you. Now by coming hot, Craig simply means moving the elbow 
to the hot or energized bushing. Our cable is secure in the bushing. And so now what remains to be done here is to reverse what they did earlier to ground the cable for the injection. That bottle of injection fluid will sit for about three hours it'll take to migrate to the other end of the injection. So for now we will simply close down this send transformer then back on the receive transformer which also is going to be a sending point for another cable injection that goes to another transformer. Going to look at the vacuum bottle here that helps bring air and fluid back and forth. Simply close down this side also and with that you have seen our TND How video on a cable injection. Again, our participating utility was Commonwealth Edison. This video was sponsored by Burns and McDonald. And I am Jim Ducart with TND How Videos. Thank you as always for watching.